The Annotation tool features a number of improvements in Origin 2017. In past versions, users could toggle different annotation formats by using the Tab button. However, the format being used would only be displayed in the message bar in the lower left corner of the workspace. Origin 2017 now displays this information next to the cursor for added convenience. In previous versions of Origin, one would have to create a new annotation to label for a different value on the same graph. In 2017, you can hold the Alt key as a modifier to easily move labels from one point to another. In the past year, we've developed a new annotation dialog, which combines the form of properties and programming control dialogs into a single convenient interface. This dialog, which can either be accessed from the right-click menu or by double-clicking on an annotation, allows you to modify label formatting, insert special characters like Greek letters, add frames, remove leader lines, manually edit label positions, and add scripts. It also allows you to add dynamic information using Origin's native syntax, like units and the long name of a worksheet. By entering this syntax, this information will update automatically as it has changed in the OPJ. We can also save this formatting as the default, allowing us to easily customize the format annotations are automatically displayed as. When working with multiple annotations on the same graph or page, the new dialog makes it easy to update changes across all objects without having to close out of the dialog and reopen it. These are just some of the many ways that annotations and many other features have been improved for Origin 2017.